This is it, ladies and gentlemen. Hell oh, man. in a cell. Nailed it. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. Nice neck breaker. Drop down. Leapfrog. I don't know about you guys, but for me, there is no greater thrill than being at the announce desk for a Hell in a Cell match. You know, I'm a little surprised, Corey, to hear you talk about the thrill of announcing a Hell in a Cell match, considering you were there when Shane McMahon shattered the announce desk at Hell in a Cell 2017. I was there too, Michael, and I'll tell you, I will never look at Hell in a Cell matches the same after that. You were? Beautiful technique. Arm drag! Very nice. The challenger's taking on some offense. You can bet he's not gonna let this golden opportunity slip so easily. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Ugh, mark my words. Boom! <laughs> guys, we oftentimes talk about the dangers of competing inside Hell in a Cell. But let's not forget these competitors aren't the only ones in there. It could be just as dangerous for the official as well. Harsh impact. You gotta believe this one's over. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, wow. I agree with Michael's point on the dangers of this match. I mean, the environment is so brutal for all involved. Just go back to look at referee Terry get uppercut. Jarring. Not just any uppercut. That one was Swiss. He's the champion into the cover. Gets the shoulder up. Not yet. Of course, guys, we all remember the 1998 battle between Mankind and Undertaker. And all these years later, fans still refer to it as one of the greatest Hell in a Cell matches of all time. He's looking at it. Ooh, what impact. Can he finish the job? As Michael was saying, I will never forget the Mankind Undertaker match. Just the sight of Mankind flying through the air is something that will be ingrained in my memory forever. And while Mankind is the story of that match, I think a lot of people forget it was actually Undertaker who walked out of that match victorious. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. You know, no matter how many times I see a Hell in a Cell match, I'm always amazed at what these competitors are willing to put themselves through. Oh, nasty impact. Harsh impact. to dispute Byron's point about what these superstars put themselves through in an environment like this. For whatever reason, when the Hell in a Cell structure is in place, superstars willingly push the boundaries of physical punishment. And then there's people like Shane McMahon who just take that to a whole other level. Oh, man, what a strike! Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, nasty impact. <laughs> the 
Beautiful technique. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. Here he goes. The longer this fight goes on, the more wear and tear on each competitor. Who is going to have enough to pick up the win? This is what makes him one of the best in the business. The champ looking a little uneasy here. His championship reign may very well be holding on by a thread. If he doesn't find a way to mount a sustained offense soon, you can bet this Hell in a Cell match would be... You gotta believe this one's over! The champ's in a bad way now, Cole. What a... He could pin his opponent right here. Two! Three! And you could put this singles match in the books. three count ends this one and there's your winner folks that was simply a case of one guy determined to prove his dominance over another wow i don't think we're going to have too many dis